but yeah, basically what I wanted to say is like the crypto scene is really like crazy and uh, you've been really, uh, uh, yeah, y y you're actually a, a legend in the crypto scene. You have your own uh, meme and everything. And uh, basically a lot has happened. And uh, yeah, I just, I'm just surprised how, how you stay so positive, honestly, with all the, like, I mean, yeah, you're just positive. People hating and you just... Positivity yeah. and all the stuff that went around. Well, let me, let me let me clear exactly the story so that your um, audience understand that uh, Carlos Matos was not uh, one of the creators of BitConnect. I was not a mastermind of that uh, organization. I was an investor and very excited investor because for the first time in my life, I was learning about cryptocurrency. For the first time in my, in my life, I was seeing possibilities that before I never thought were possible. So I was extremely excited. And then when I started investing on this thing, I invested $25,610. And in, in very few, few uh, you know, time, it became like $125,000. I was shocked because I'm an investor in stocks and different things and those kinds of uh, percentage games, I have never seen them in, in the kind of things that I, you know, that I'm constantly investing. So I was so shocked. I was so impressed. I said, this is it. And, I'm, and not only that, I'm going to have to share this with the rest of the world because imagine, you know, the, imagine the impact that something like this can have. So when you invest $25,610 in BitConnect, BitConnect automatically has uh, a uh, system that will give you a pass or access to their annual ceremony. That's the way that I got there. It was not because... I was, you know, uh, paid or there was a contract that they had with me so that I can do that speech. No, I was an enthusiastic investor like so many others who were in a line who wanted to share the story. And when I was there at the annual conference, I loved it. And it was like, whoa, you know, let's get the party started. I was so excited. Everything was going here. There was a lot of people. It was beautiful. I mean, they, these people spend a lot of a lot of money. They want to flash everybody. They they actually went crazy with the facility and with everything. They were even giving Lamborghinis and, and you know all kinds of different cars and everything as a gift to the major uh, promoters of the you know of, of BitConnect. It was crazy. So. You know, I am a very high power energy individual. So if you put me in a position where I am talking to an audience, I am going to bring the house down. Knock on wood. That's the effect that I have. I'm a powerful speaker. So I said to myself, man, I'm just going to tell my story and I'm going to let it roll. And when I went there, I didn't prepare anything. But it was just my excitement. I was excited about what I was saying I was doing. And uh, yeah, it just rolled. And, you know, it became what it became. Maybe it went viral and everybody, you know, saw that what BitConnect was. And, you know, uh, some people lost their money with BitConnect. That is true. But I don't know why so many people are really... Um, kind of, you know, uh, surprised about that because the the people in it were masterminding a scam. Yeah, that's true. That's correct. But investing is a risky proposition. The moment that you're going to invest, you have got to understand that the biggest, the, you know, the bigger the, the reward, the bigger the risk. So if you see something that's going up like that, I know I, I said to myself, now oh, this this thing. So one law that I always have in investing is that the moment you invest, if it doubles or triples, take your money out. Take your money out. So my money was out when I already was there in, in Bitconnect. My the seed that I put in it was out. 
Um, in when I left the annual ceremony, uh, BitConnect continued growing, and he, 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 I think, he went above a quarter of a million dollars. Now, I said to myself, this thing is just gonna gonna go crazy, and all of a sudden, boom, it collapsed, and I lost everything. But was I like, you know, like the world's gonna end and everything is going to? No, I was not that way because as an investor, I understood that that's just something that was, you know. Do, 